Hey guys, and welcome back to Devil's Third. When we last left off, I'm pretty sure we had sound, whereas now I do not have sound. There we go, that's better. So we had to destroy the enemy tank, which of course we did. Ah, yeah, I remember. I actually had to stop playing because the frame rate. <laughs> oh my god, the frame rate was uh, really distracting as it is here. Never mind. Ow, that was painful. I'm sure we can just call a dutes our way through this. I mean, what could possibly go wrong, right? Literally enemy assholes everywhere. Wow. Okay. Big Mouse's personal data. Um, why is it telling us about Big Mouse? Pretty, pretty sure we, we killed that guy. Ah, they're not letting up. No, they're not. How do you aim? How do you actually aim? Oh my god. Right. Let's just try and... Oh, there are boys. Okay. So, I... <laughs> oh, no. Stella. So, she's 26. And she's an, she's 26 and she's an Air Force Major. Um, right. Okay. Why not? Why not? I mean, if there is any collectibles out here in the wide open, then I don't think we're going to get them. Oof. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh no, not Bob. Let's not lose Bob. Try not and get any blood on his uh, rather fetching scarf of his. Wait, one of these guys has got an axe and he's got a hard one for me as well. I guess that makes sense. Wow. Where the hell do we get one of those suits? Literally everybody firing at him. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's all good. It's all good, bro. It's all good. It's all fine. See what I mean? Like, this is the weird thing with an auto cover system. The fact that it's just pulling you constantly from what you're doing, pulling you into cover. It's, you know, it was never a good idea for an auto cover system. And it really doesn't work here either. Like, at all. Okay, so I guess we're going upstairs. I would have thought that would have been a prime location for a collectible, but... There was probably collectibles out here. <gasps> My god, guys. Guys. Holy shit. I think we're hitting 30 frames a second. Oh, shit. Okay. Nice. And all it took was a tiny little corridor and tiny rooms. Alright, let's go. Well, we ain't going that way. Now you know there's some shit going to go down in here. Oh, well, cutscene. So, why did we have to get out of the hotel in a hurry? Oh, he looks fine. Hey, wait. The fuck? Follow the mysterious survivor. Uh, yeah, sure. Okay. Alright, well... We'll go find him in a second. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're on it. We're on it. Let's go see if there's any goodies around here. Hey, the game's actually... Okay. <laughs> I was going to say the game's actually quite smooth out here as well, but uh, no, not really. This game's installed to a hard drive as well, so we can't even blame the fact that it's got to keep pulling data off the disk. Not that that's an excuse at all. 
Yeah, let's go see. Oh, hello. Um, I think that's a collect. Okay, that is a collectible. You just have to like stand on the uh, hood of the car for some reason. Uh, what's up with this guy? Uh, um, do we, do we have zombies? Whatever it is, it's not human. I think it was human. Sending an image for evaluation. Oh, he's twitching. We got twitches. Nah, totally unrelated. Nothing to do with the sods. Hey, look, remember when I said they're going to reuse assets constantly? And there we go. Alright, so we have zombies now? Ooh, we've got a badass sniper rifle. Um, Yeah, maybe? I actually think that's a low caliber sniper rifle, to be honest. The built-in silencer. But hey... Sure game. Let's go with that. I like, you know, I do prefer these um, tighter environments in this game. They just seem to be better. Wow. Okay, it's uh, it's, be Ooh, it's become really quiet. I was about to say. Yeah, I can see them. So this is why you wanted me to have a sniper rifle. I see. Cool, got ya. Ooh. Don't... Yeah, I don't think we can really do much with our sniper rifle. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah. Right. I... Thin him out? How? I guess I'm going to sit here. You can't sit here because you just get shot at. Ah, okay, so. Right, so basically, uh, if you step on the middle of the bridge, you just hit a death point. Got ya. So we have to somehow thin them out from over here whilst we're being shelled with no apparent cover. Cool. How, how standard of you, game? How do you aim? Oh my god. Yeah. Alright, alright, alright. Yeah, no shit. You know, we probably would have been able to do something with these guys. But there's only so much we can achieve at five frames a second. I also don't think this rifle zeroed in very well. Oof. 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 Okay, we got this. Let's just keep thinning out the drones. Yes, I shall use my glasses. Because I guess... I guess the game developers thought this was cool? Alright, take that out, please. Ooh. Alright, that's... Oh, okay, is that recharging or... Yeah. I guess it's got a bit of a cooldown. Right. Please destroy those. Thank you. Well, I guess the major wasn't really thinking. I think her lack of experience at the age of 26 is showing. All right, one at a time. Dumb hatch. Right, 
Underground facility. Hey, we're going to have like zombies in this game. That would be odd. Watch I like... That ceiling's unstable. Mm hmm. I like the way we don't need one of those powered exosuits. We're just a badass. We're powered. Oh, what the fuck? Are you serious? Animal lab. Experiments or some shit. Jesus Christ. Delta, we may lose they like their bats. Deeper, they really like their bats in this game. Alright, so it appears we're getting somewhere. No, we do not want the rusty ass pipe when we've got a freaking katana. I'll pass, thank you. Alright, not bad. I mean, it kind of looks like the prison from before. Ooh. Oh, God. Hello. Didn't even see these guys. Yep. Thank you. Thank you. Just attack me straight away. Didn't even see them. <laughs> sure. Why not? Hey, fucker. Have some sword. I mean, we know they mentioned, like, biological stuff earlier. So, ah, uh, fireman axe, nah. I mean, like, the katana just seems to be better than the other melee weapons. So, why, you know, why would you choose anything else? You know, the variety in the melee weapons is basically zero. They all do the same thing. But then, I guess you can say the same thing for the... For the actual rifles as well and the guns they're just they're all the same you know step one has a flamethrower oh well they don't look like normal humans do they cool we got like fucking zombies is this gonna go resident evil 6 on us this is gonna go resident evil 6 isn't it Yeah, yeah, we've got zombie monster things. Ooh, hello. Uh, oh, what's that? A streetcar, really? Okay, ooh, fire actually hurts us. I'm impressed. Should I be impressed? Maybe. Right, come on, guys. We have zombies to defeat, apparently. Who would have thunked it? I, mean, I suppose we've got ninjas. Ooh. <laughs> okay. Invincible zombies? Zombies that just stand there and do nothing. Right, got ya. Uh. Are they actually. Yeah, okay. Fire does seem to be somewhat effective. Fire is good. Flamethrowers. I like it. And we didn't lose any generic soldiers. Now, can I go back and get another one? Because I really want some more flamethrower fuel if we're going to... No, all the... I thought as much. All the guns have despawned because we hit some kind of cutscene. And I guess the whole level refreshed. Come on, Nick. Oh, what the fuck is that? What is that? Is it like some weird mole man? I mean, come on. You just look stupid. This is definitely just some like asset flip early access game. I mean, uh, what the fuck was that? Look, there's another one. I like they don't have any textures. Ooh. Although he does knock my fucking out does knock my sword out of my hand, which is a little bit awkward. Okay. 
so we have mutants we have werewolves i guess but they don't have any fur they're like big teddy bears really oh, i need coffee for this this is i mean when you think a game literally can't get any worse and then you get what whatever the fuck that is i mean it looks like some Zedless horror film. It really. It's just. I. I mean, what? Like, did they? Did they even try to make something freaky? Oh, it just. It looks so bad. Oh no! Like, ugh. Come on, you. Yeah, mum. I mean, look at that. Look, you know what it looks like? It's like a children. Oh, yeah, I see. So they don't actually go after the AI. They only go after us. It looks like um, if Disney tried to come up with something horrific and to scare the little children and failed miserably. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. I mean, these things don't look too bad. These actual zombies look fairly cool. But those weird teddy bear things, I mean, they look like bat people. Kind of. Yeah, that. I mean, come on. Come on. I like the way they put us in corridors where we can't really avoid the fucker either. Where's our AI? Is the AI just given up? I think the AI's given up. I mean, the AI on these things ain't brilliant, is it? Although they do have absurdly long reach. What? I mean, come on. What is that? It's got like a wolf head thing. Ah, oh, fuck knows, mate. I don't know. I don't even know. I don't even know what they're trying to go with that, to be honest. Like, the actual zombie people look fairly good. They look cool. What's the plan, sir? No, no one gonna mention that. No, no one even gonna bring that up. All right, cool, sure. This place. Back to hospital. Move. Ooh. See that looks okay. Almost looked like they tried. We can't be oh, we're absolutely serious. Wow, okay. These things are fairly resistant to blades. Yeah, they are. Okay. Yeah, well, too bad, soldier, because this is the situation we find ourselves in. Yeah, that dodge. The dodge just doesn't work. Yeah, there we go. Trying to dodge. It, like, I, I don't know. I, I don't know whether it's tied to, like, the frame rate. Or whether it's just because there's such a huge input delay. Oh. Yeah, I think it's more of the fact that there's such an input delay with anything you try to do. There we go. Oof. It's definitely no Operation Raccoon City. Um, we do have the fu uh, this thing with the flamethrower, so let's give that a go on these standard zombies. Especially considering we can always just get some more fire. <laughs> oh no. Ah, uh, not all games are equal, guys. Not all games are equal. Okay, let's have a little look. See if there's any goodies stashed around. Like, what is that? Oh, okay. I guess that's water. Got ya. Uh, I mean, someone arrived on their mopad. 
It's interesting that and it's like certain enemies can knock your melee weapon out of your hand. I kind of think that Ooh. That is a potentially interesting mechanic, but they just didn't do anything with it. Let's split up. Yeah, that's smart. We'll check the west side. Ivan, you take the east. Okay. Nick, go with Ivan. Oh, yes, Nick's sir. dead. Nick's a goner. Alright, now, do we have any goodies around here? What the hell kind of hospital was this? I think another problem... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think another problem with the... The game as well is it's kind of like if you've ever played Ninja Gaiden, you'll know that you have such an incredible range of movement. You can flip all over the place. You you can bounce off the scenery. You can hang onto the scenery. You can do loads of stuff. In this game, oh, and you get a buttery smooth 60 FPS as well. In this game, you just you can't really move around the environments. You're constantly getting stuck on stuff, and there's areas like this that you just they're just invisible walls you know it's it's just really shit anyway let's go come on Nick yeah well this ain't exactly like any hospital I've ever seen but okay I mean this well we've got a fucking movie theater here Jesus Interesting to find a door that we can open with an ammo box, although I don't know why we need an ammo box because we've just come. Oh, hello. Uh, calm down, dude. Looks like someone's still working here. What, him? I don't think he's working here anymore, dude. I think he's dead. Operating. Look at how bland this all is. It's just. There's no detail on anything. I mean, even the shotgun. You've got the cartridge loops on the shotgun, but there's no cartridges in it. It's oh man. I've seen asset flip flip games where they even get that right. Hey, we got another pinky. I like pinkies from Doom. I think that's what these things are meant to be. Alright. Come on, Nick. Big terrifying monster. Ah, Jesus Christ. Okay, let's go. There's a fire axe, but we've got a sword, so... Not sure why we'd want that. Sounds like this place crawls. Oh. Yeah, well. Yeah, we're fine, buddy. We're just fighting generic mutant zombie things. Hey, friend. Yeah, we know, buddy. You, you don't need to keep staying. It's okay, man. I'm sure we've got this. I mean, I think we've got this. Yeah, and remember when I said about the whole Ninja Gaiden freedom of movement thing? How easy it is to fly around the environment, bounce off walls, that kind of stuff. In this game, the only thing you can really do is get stuck on the environment and glitched into corners. There we go. Uh, zombies, you know, the same zombies that we've been fighting, like, throughout the entire level. Have you been asleep the whole time? Uh, oh, there's loads of explosive barrels in here. Right. Power is out. 
There should be emergency generators. It's a hospital for Christ's sake. Well, yeah, that does make sense. I'm glad they stuck us with someone with such a rich personality. Nick, we're going to really miss you when you die. Alright, let's get this done. Oh, okay, we've just literally walked into a room and... Hey, emergency power generator. Straight off the bat. Can I not glitch into the wall, please? Is that okay? Is that a thing that we can avoid doing? I mean, there is no movement at all. Come on. There we go. Hose him down. He's still not dead. Okay, so sometimes fire stuns you, and sometimes it doesn't. Got ya. Also, when you run out of ammo for your flamethrower, it doesn't auto-switch you. Good. Good. Okay. Turn the jennies on. Now. Oh, good. The light. Wow. The light really tanks the frame rate. Excellent. Yep. <laughs> Even out here as well. Nice. Just what I wanted. I was... I was... Uh, I did it. Thanks, Nick. Y y cheers, buddy. You're one of the good ones, Nick. You gonna get in here today, or...? Okay. Hopefully it's dark downstairs. Well, I guess we've run into a nest of uglies, too. Is that Nick screaming? What the fuck happened to him? Did he just spawn? I think he just like... Oh, can they not... Okay, they can. I was going to say, can they not get into the elevator? I guess they can. I, d I have no idea what's going on, guys. I think the camera's gone through the wall. That's cool. Right, okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. Ooh. I mean, that works. And how come sometimes... Sometimes we can one-hit kill these zombies, and other times they take, like, an entire combo. Oof. Ooh, they're dogs. Wonder what they were. And that's another pinky. Oh, that thing's not dead. Or is it? Looks like a monkey. What the hell is all this? Oh, I don't know, Nick. Yeah, Maybe. A medical facility down here. Another testing lab. No, sir. Still alive. Christ. Finish your sweep and get out of there ASAP. Yeah, pretty sure none of these are gonna come to life at any point. That is pretty gribbly though. Look at that. See, we actually get some cool stuff here. Oof. That's pretty yeah, pretty rough. Anyway guys, we're actually out of time, so. Uh, I'm going to end this video here. Ugh, this game. What a mixed... Jesus. I don't... You know, it feels like some... I don't even know what it feels like. It feels like a couple of kids quickly put this together in their basement and pitched it to Steam Greenlight. Greenlight rejected it and somehow it ended up on the Wii U. That's what it feels like. I'm trying to think of some redeeming qualities for this game. I'm trying. But, you know, I'm trying to be really fair, but... 
it's just it's just utter dog shit <laughs> it really is it's probably one of the worst games that i've ever played but we're gonna get through it we are <sighs> my god i'm gonna have to fucking i don't know get my fucking wii u exercised after this i think anyway till next time guys 